I'm John Elfar. I'm the Vice Chairman of Orthopedic Surgery and Rehabilitation at the Pennsylvania State University. Ner nerves are what control everything, what you feel and what you can do, uh, what you can move. They're all under nerve control, the way your brain gets those signals to your fingers and your toes and your legs is through nerves. I'm an orthopedic surgeon, so I see traumatized patients. Uh, I see patients who've had their nerves cut by the bullet that's going through the tissue or, uh, or a car accident, a bad mangling injury. These are the kinds of injuries I see. But all over the medical center, you will find peripheral nerve injuries that are the consequence of care. There's a lot of very sad uh, patients who have the cancer out but can't move the limb or who get treated with radiation but can't feel. 4-aminopyridine was a drug we just happened uh, to come across. It's called 4-AP, um, and we, we were using it in experiments in the lab for a totally different purpose. We were trying to use it to tell whether or not our nerve injuries were bad enough. That's currently impossible right now, even with all of the greatest tools we have. All the greatest imaging, we can't tell whether a nerve has been cut or not. The cool thing about 4-AP is it's currently used in humans. Uh, so it's FDA approved, so we have dosages that are safe in humans, for example. When we use a small dose of 4-AP, we can take a nerve that looks like it's been cut and make it function for the short enough time we need to tell that it hasn't been cut. The second discovery was if we took nerves that have been injured, we could very uh, substantially increase the rate at which they recover um, with continuous dosing of this drug. 4-AP has applications uh, so far beyond my own field that I haven't had any problems interesting surgeons and physicians from other departments in helping. Uh, we have trials currently uh, planned uh, and we're writing grants for trials in neurology, in neurosurgery, in urology, uh, uh, in general surgery uh, that you wouldn't expect 4-AP, but yeah, actually 4-AP has tremendous traction in fields where nerve injuries are an obligate consequence of care that is really important. You find other departments that are very interested. Right now, we have an opportunity, because we're on this cusp, we have an opportunity to actually try a treatment, as opposed to do the extra stuff required to justify trying the treatment. We want to go and take the test. All we want to do is take the actual test.